What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. It's free general collective reading for all times. Cap suicide, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, that apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Free general collective reading. Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess 205. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only, no cash app, no Venmo. It's a very private, confidential way to donate. If you choose to donate, love you guys so much. All right, so I received a channel message. I hope everybody's doing well. Uh, I do. I received a channel message, so I'm going to deliver it. Um, the channel message I received was um, an Aquarius. I heard an Aquarius energy is um, strategically hiding the fact um uh, someone is a drug addict. I heard a uh, secret drug addict, but I heard through um, many series of chain of events, it is about to backfire on them. Um, I heard they're about to get pulled in as accomplice energy because this person is about to be exposed as a huge drug addict, and they're about to throw this Aquarius under the table. For some of these Aquariuses, it is their family member. For some, it is a lover. Um, Aquarius, uh, Aquarius energy. So for some, it's family member. For some, it's a lover. You plug it in, how it resonates, whoever this Aquarius is. They can have Aquarius in any aspect of their chart. Sun, moon, rising, Venus, north, node, been here Jupiter charts. Uh, for some of these um, some of these Aquariuses, it is a family member of this person. For some, it is a lover. I don't know why this is so significant in the energetic space today, but apparently it is. So you plug it in, how it resonates, you guys, okay? But some, um, the, whoever, whatever sign, I didn't hear a sign of whoever this person is. Spirit message, I didn't hear a sign of who this person is. But they are about to, um, they're about to, um, I heard take the first one. This is the first one. They are about to, um, throw the Aquarius under the bus. Like, and... I know some of you guys are recovering addicts, and I don't slam the recovering addicts. I think recovering addicts are wonderful, as long as you can keep sober, keep sober and keep clean. I think those kind of people are very brave and wonderful, if you can keep clean, not relapse. But whoever, but by saying that, when people are in drug addict mode, they're very selfish. They're very selfish. They only think of themselves. They're very greedy. Very narcissistic. Take, 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 take. Always take and take and take and take and take it. Always. To feed their addictions. To feed their hunger. To feed, 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 feed. Doesn't matter what they do to other people. As long as they get what they want. When they're in drug addict mode. No, I'm not talking about former recovering addicts. Absolutely not. Okay? Um, so... Whoever this sign is uh, connected to this Aquarius. Some of these Aquariuses, it is their lover. It sounds like current sexual connection lover. For some, it is a family member. But it is about to backfire on them because the secret addict, my point saying all that, the secret addict is very selfish. They're about to throw this Aquarius under the bus, whether the Aquarius likes it or not, because it's going to, uh, it's either going to help them throwing the Aquarius under the bus or they think it's going to help them. I didn't hear any of that. That's just my deductive logic and reasoning. The Aquarius is going to have to accept this. Um, accept this fact. Number 41 could be a very significant number in one's life. Number 41. It could be a possible age of one of these Aquariuses or the lover or the family member or what have you, what have you. Or any other significant number. Number 41. Some of these Aquariuses, they are a lawyer. For some, they are, hold on, I'm sorry. For some, they are a lawyer. For some, they are, um, oh shit, I forgot. I heard the other one. Hold on, give me a second, I'm sorry. I heard, I did hear lawyer very, oh, a doctor. For some, they are a lawyer, and for some, they are a doctor. For some, they are a veteran. Retired veteran. 
Okay, so for some of these Aquariuses, they are a lawyer, for some they are a doctor, and for some they are a retired veteran. So um, I feel for some you might be the Aquariuses, or for some you might be the drug addict, or you might know the drug addict, or you might know the Aquarius. You have to plug yourself in where you fit. There's a reason I'm pulling this in. Um, I'm not sure. I've already done all the sign readings for the first week of October, so I wasn't even going to do sign. I honestly wasn't going to do anything but the daily tea today. I just happened to get on here because I got this channel message. So um, I've already been walking and all that today. So I wasn't even planning on doing this is what I'm trying to say. Because all the sign readings are caught up and everything. So I don't know. But um, whoever this is, um, it's significant to somebody out there. Aquarius. Sun, moon, rising, Venus, fourth them in heaven, Jupiter, charts. The secret drug addict. The secret drug addict is either a family member or a lover, current lover, to the Aquarius. So I'm thinking girlfriend, boyfriend, fiance, sneaky link, or third party. We have the Aquarius. The Aquarius can either be a doctor or a lawyer or a, re a retired veteran. Doctor, lawyer, or retired veteran. The Aquarius is going to have to accept the fact they're about to get asked about to get thrown under the bus because this person is about to get exposed. And this person is very high, a uh, very, very much in the public eye, water sign energy. And this public, this person is very much in the public eye, water sign energy. Okay, so this person, this water sign, what masculine or feeling water sign is about to throw this Aquarius under the bus. This person is very much in the public eye. So that could be 3D workspace energy, social media workspace energy, or both. How that resonates apply, uh, applies or any other public eye energy. They're very much in the public eye. The Aquarius, I feel, is going to have to accept the fact they're about to get betrayed by their lover or their family member. Um, very heavily public eye, water sign. Family member or current lover. Um, the Cancer Pisces Scorpio, whoever they are, okay? Mask or Femme Cancer Pisces Scorpio. The Aquarius is going to have to accept the fact, and the Cancer Pisces Scorpio is about to accept the fact their ass is about to get exposed very publicly. They are a drug user. Um, I don't know if they're about to get accepted with a surprise drug screening in their employment, or CPS gets involved and requests a drug screen, or any other way a drug screen will be um, can be given. However, that resonates and applies. Automatically think CPS. Automatically think. Work workplace surprise drug screens because those two th ways they can they can now of course with CPS you can refuse the drug screen and get a lawyer involved of course but if you have nothing to hide there's nothing, nothing wrong with peeing in the cup I mean I offer when CPS used to come to my house I used to offer to pee in the cup and that's just the truth and I had CPS call to me six times in a year six times last year true story. So whoever this Cancer Pisces Scorpio is, Scorpio is, it's very heavily in the public eye, masculine or feminine, whether they're a family member or a um, um, current lover of the um, Aquarius. Um, the Aquarius, I heard they are either a doctor, a lawyer, or a retired veteran. They're going to have to accept the fact this person's about to betray them. The water sign's about to accept the fact their ass is about to get exposed for being a drug user. Damn. This water sign's life is about to fall apart in huge ways. Huge ways. They live too much in the dark. Okay, I heard this water sign's life is about to fall apart in huge ways. They live too much in the dark. So action card number 17 can be a very significant number. Number 17. They're going to have to accept the fact that, um, that their life is about to fall apart in huge ways. I heard they live too much in the dark, so there's a lot of hidden secrets or hidden things or um, a lot of hidden something, whatever it is. Um, I think this water side, I heard they live in the dark, so I think they're dark side and they have dark attachments attached to them. Number five could be a very significant number in one's life, number five. Um, I think they have dark 
evil entity attachments attached to them. It's exactly what I think. Um, or they're codependent. Well, they're definitely codependent on drugs. They're definitely code, there's codependency there on drugs. But I think they might be codependent on other people, maybe for money or the drugs or other codependencies. Or this could be evil attachments, evil entity attachments. You plug it in how it resonates, but um, codependency, evil attachments, dark side energy. I think this Aquarius is about to have to accept the, accept the fact that this water sign is like this, is what I'm feeling. They did not want to accept it, but soon they're about to have to. These two are about to be forced apart. Forced apart. Oh my God. Okay, I heard this Aquarius didn't want to accept this. Accept the fact they are a dark side. All the drug addictions. All the issues here. Psychological issues. Mental health issues, basically. But uh, I heard they're about to have to. Uh, they're about to be forced apart. So they're about to be forced apart. Sounds like through many series of came events, forced apart. So I think... He or she might have to go to rehab, for either free willing go to rehab or forced to go to rehab if something happens in the public and maybe the police get involved and the uh, mental health institution gets involved or something. I didn't hear any of that, but somehow they're going to be forced apart. So that's what makes me think that possibly in one situation. In another situation, they might free willing off. They might free willing go to the mental health rehabilitation, like drug rehab or something. But however that resonates, however the mini series of chain events occur, they're going to be forced apart. The Aquarius and the water sign. Lovers or family members. So the Aquarius is about to have to accept this. I think the Aquarius was a little codependent on maybe this person too. There was equal codependency here, but it's about to be forced apart. There was equal codependency here, but it's about to be forced apart. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. The thinking man reverse number 46 could be a very significant number in one's life too. Number 46, the thinking man reverse. This is about to happen quick. Very quickly. And this water sign got falls high on her in the past. Piggy, they, uh, they accepted high honor for someone else's bravery and strength and their rewards and accolades in the past but through many series of chain events this water sign is about to be stripped of all of that and communication is about to come to the person that should have had it all along the truth man this water sign just did the most holy crap they got secret addictions they're codependent i mean they're the most and that's just the truth. Oh, it's terrible energy. Terrible. I certainly feel they have dark attachments to them. They probably utilize um, dark arts. But however that resonates, these two are like peas in a pod, whether they're family members or they are lovers. But they're about to be forced apart. I'm thinking rehab in one of these situations. I'm just being for real with this water sign. But uh, but it's, it's about to happen fast. It's about to happen fast. And... Uh, Somehow this water sign received accolades and rewards and basically took all the credit for an a femme energy of their past credit. They took the credit of a feminine energy's accolades, rewards, credit of a feminine energy when they shouldn't have. Now this could be a masculine femme water sign. Plug it in how it resonates. But they took the credit, the accolades, the awards, everything a feminine energy should have had in, of their past. They took credit for it. But once all this occurs, it sounds like the drugs being exposed publicly and um, whatever else the hell's about to be exposed. These two are about to be forced apart and what have you, what have you, whether it's a lawyer, a doctor, or a veteran, a uh, retired veteran. Um, it's about to be exposed that this water sign basically took credit, accolades, praise, maybe money. Or whatever they took, energy, time, or money, praise, accolades, awards, what have you, what have you, of the feminine energy of their past. It's about to be exposed. And I heard communications about to get to the feminine energy um, that it should have gotten to. That should have had the praise, awards, accolades, money, whatever the hell it was. Okay? For some, it could be stolen inheritance or property or what have you, what have you. But whatever was stolen that this person basically took from a feminine energy of their past. 
They're a huge ass addict. They have no problems taking from others. Obviously. Including whatever praise, accolades, awards, money, property, whatever, whatever. And I heard it's going to happen fast, so not thinking about it anymore. This is fast, 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 fast energy. Um, not giving it any more thought. About to do it. And I think the Aquarius is about to have to accept it. I think the Aquarius fought against this feminine energy in the past. I think they fought against her. They most certainly did. And they are about to seriously regret it in a huge way. Okay, I heard they most certainly did. And they're about to seriously regret it in a huge way. So this Aquarius, whether they're a retired veteran, uh, um, a doctor, or a lawyer, they fought against this feminine energy in the past to get her praises, recognitions, rewards, accolades, money, property, assets, inheritances, whatever the hell it was she was supposed to get that this water sign, succubus, basically took from her ass. And they had no right to do it. Masculine or feminine water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. This person, the doctor, the lawyer, or the um, retired veteran, fought again. They didn't want her to have it. But they're about to have to accept the fact she's about to get it, basically. It's about to give them a huge-ass wake-up call. It's about to give them a huge-ass wake-up call. It's about to give this Aquarius a huge-ass wake-up call. Well, why this Aquarius didn't want this person to have what they were rightfully supposed to have, I don't know. Because that, that doesn't make mental sense. Uh, and I'm just being for real. I don't care how they try to spin it. That doesn't make mental sense. It really doesn't. If you, if it is yours, you're supposed to have it, good or bad, then you're supposed to have it. If you're supposed to be in jail for charge or in prison for charge or charges, you're supposed to have it. If you're supposed to have inheritance, money, or property, or um, an award, or a positive accolade, then you're supposed to have it. Changing and twisting people's destinies always leads to bad, 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 bad. If you, apparently, this Aquarius needs to hear that. Because it sounds like they were in the... They conspired with this water sign to twist somebody's destiny. The hands of destiny. Because this is exactly what this is. Twisting the hands of destiny. Someone's getting a huge wake-up call. Someone's getting a huge wake-up call. But it's about to balance out in a huge way through many series of chain of events. Okay, I heard someone's getting a huge wake-up call, but it's about to balance out through many series of chain of events. So, um, yeah, they're about to have to accept the fact that they basically conspired with somebody behind the scenes of this feminine energy's back to um, twist their destiny. So, like, bullying, harassing, targeting, and gang-stalking, and um, conspiracy. I'm not, well, yeah, they did. They conspired together to do it. This is terrible. Except it really did happen. It's not like a conspiracy theory. It really was conspiring in action to do this shit. Because it really did happen in the universe. So it's unlike a conspiracy theory. Holy shit. Alright, I love you guys. Namaste.